But y'all see that how she did it? You, you, cause I only want you. Yeah, cause I only want you. Yeah. What's up, everybody? It's your girl C. We out for another video. So today I am finna let y'all tour with me to go handle some business. So the first things first. Um, before we get to this video, hit like, come subscribe to the channel. If you're new, hit like, come subscribe to this channel. Make sure you hit that bell, share, 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 and let this video roll. So, okay. I am going to my doctor's office, go get my Botox for my migraines. Um, <clears throat> man, what? My headaches be off the rip, okay? So, I had to get this uh, specialty like every three months because due to my severe migraines, also, I have like a medicine called MV and Brevi. So, the medicine, so I get like um MV, I get the ingestion every month and then put it towards my thigh for my migraines. And also, really, it's just like uh, like my emergency medicine. So, just in case it start hurting real bad. Y'all know if y'all y'all deal with severe migraines, leave a comment below because this is a streaming, streaming, streaming painful situation i can't deal with no light i can't deal with none of this situation it just irking my nerves at this time so i'm gonna go sign up for surgical tech because you know in my last video i told y'all i was going to nursing school but i decided i don't want to do that and i had some other situations why i didn't want to do it so i'm gonna briefly tell y'all the reason why you know go deep off in so Y'all gonna go walk with me into my doctor's appointment. So this lady trying to turn me around. Talking about she got the wrong person, but come to find out me and my daughter's on the same account. Like I said, can you just double check and make sure? Because I know I'm at the right location. I need this ejection bag because my migraine is killing me. So we finally at the location trying to get my stuff done. Because I'm gonna show y'all how it works with the Botox and stuff and see because they had to go like up in this session this session up here up here then right here right here to the back to my neck so y'all gonna see it's gonna be 31 injections and so i'm back here now i gotta get my hair done i'm gonna wash my hair too today but I'm back here now, finna get ready to get my ingestions. Um, we sit here talking and try to get things situated. Yeah, I know this light is very, very bright. On my head, y'all see all that? It's very, very bright. And I can't deal with it. So I'm just trying to figure out what I need to do for us that goes because I'm about to go insane with this downgone migraine. So, um, once the, um, I think she's a PA, because I never dealt with her before. You know, I used to go to the other one, but I need a mercy, get seen by somebody trying to do my ingestion. So, um, I ain't ass when you got migraines, severe migraines, you can't help it. So, you trying to find all types of ways, turn the lights off, put the head under the pillow, the blanket, and put a cold towel, try to take all types of medicine, still don't help. I'm gonna cut some things out because some of the stuff is my personal situation. But when she comes, I'm gonna um, show y'all the technique, how she do it, and go from there. And let's get it started. <laughs> Sitting on the grassland side by side You could be my baby Let me make you my baby Girl, you amaze me Ain't gotta do nothing crazy See, all I want you to do is be my love So don't give away 
my life So don't give away my life So don't give away And another woman that can take your spot, my love So don't give away my life So don't give away my life So don't give away And another woman that can take your spot, my love Botox, y'all. Y'all seen that man's hurt. She, she quick. I ain't never been to her, but she's quick. I like her straight. I'm gonna come back and do this again. So, we're gonna go to the next spot and we'll be right back. Yeah, y'all see that? Y'all was on top of my dangerous. But y'all see that? How she did it? She got all over the place. And then she got in my neck, in my back, you know. So, I, you know, I had to get permission to, you know, record. But, you know, I couldn't really get the back of it in my neck. But it was so quick, like, just quick. So, I was like, I feel so much better. to get my emergency um, medicine come in. So, um, so, I could take it as needed. Because I really, really need it because it's so severe half the time. Y'all want to know, okay, well, what made you switch to nursing into surgical tech so i love nursing don't get me wrong i'm not gonna say that i didn't i love nursing it's a lot of work versus surgical tech all the difference between uh them two was you know you know i ain't had to go through all that hassle with the background chair versus nursing you know for my previous past i have a um i've been a convicted felony okay I ain't gonna go no details why, but um, you know that. So I had a hard time trying to get in through the nursing board, and it was hard for me to get in. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and try to um, change my career because I didn't want to go through that house. So I could have went through, you know, I could have fought it, beat it, whatever. But that's not my passion, what I really want to do in nursing. I have a lot of people ask me, you know, go and finish nursing. But the school I had applied for was Chamberlain, and it was too damn high. You know what I'm saying? The school cost was $90,000, plus all my prereqs and all that. It was just still too high for everything. So I just couldn't deal with the pricing. I couldn't deal with none of that. So I want something cheaper, more reasonable. I mean, school's going to be high regardless. But at least I know that I'm going to get through with no problem. Finally, I my stuff went through. Everything came back good um, versus everything went back good, good with um, well, nursing. Just when I went to the, the test is nursing board, that's when I had an issue. So now I'm changing my career to still, you know, have better, um, you know, opportunity um save money and stuff like that for my family because i can't keep on sitting here and doing the same thing with medical assisting i've been doing medical assisting over some 19 years it's time to do something else so i have to gradually surprise for y'all but i'm not gonna tell it right now and i'm gonna tell you another reason why i want to make more money and and you know do bigger things and stuff so but I'm just going to keep that secret for y'all. So if y'all want to know what the surprise is, leave a comment below. And what y'all think of the surprise is. And maybe I would tell y'all, you know, maybe I'm not. You know, it all depends. So let's go up here to the school. I'm going to drive to this location so I can finish up signing up for my school and go from there. So I finally came up here. Um, I had to take another test, pass it for flying colors um, to get in the program. I um, had to make it 17. I write on the head of the 17. So I had to go ahead and finish uh, registered. I mean, I already did most of it, but I got to finish registered. And then after that, I'll be done and go from there. So I'm going to just tour y'all around. 
Um, let's see how the surgical tip uh, will be. So I just took my picture and then get my uniforms. Trying to see what's going on. And after that, um, show y'all the classroom. Trying to see if my credits will transfer over. I do have a secondary school. They I know for a fact it transfer everything over. So just in case if they don't transfer, at least I know they will transfer. So we'll let you know. We'll so. I just found out my tuition this it's okay. The payment's gonna be kinda a little high, but once we get the transcript down, hopefully I will pass this tuition. Done for the day. I had to take a pause and pay attention on the uh surgical tech, how they do things. So uh it's very interesting, you know, you got to learn all your instruments, you got to learn all your, um, the way how you operate your movements, which side you got to work on for your dominant hand. It's a lot you got to learn, because I ain't perfect, but I want to learn more, but um, I'm going to look at one more school, um, but that school don't start to fall, but this school already starts in May. But the thing is, I'm be out for like a couple of months because I already took some of these credits. And, um, which would be good and it would just be bad, but it's okay though. At least I will find out what's what, but I need to know which one be better. I don't want to be sitting there in no, um, no school forever. I don't want to be in school forever. That's why I don't want to be. But I do want to do what's best for my family. But a good thing about it is, um, I'll be um, staying in school for like a year and six months, so which that's good compared to the other schools. The other schools like two years and stuff. So I'm just trying to see. I'm gonna try one more school and see. But the thing is, I have to wait to fall, and I ain't want to wait that long. I want to go ahead and start school right then and there. So I go ahead and just finish because I don't want to be in school forever. But I think I made my choice. But I want to do a secondary thing. But um, I don't know. I'm just iffy. I don't know what y'all think about that. Because sometimes you be iffy. Like, do you want to stay in school for two years? Do you? You know, it's just it's real iffy about it. But I just go ahead and just um, go from uh, just go ahead and just finish. Do my one year and a half and just call it a day yes um i had to leave my job because i want to go ahead and finish school to do surgical tech because surgical tech is like day shift only but um i don't want to see him feel like i don't have no job but i'm going to i do have other income coming in i ain't gonna say i I don't have no job, but I have other income. It's just not the medical system job no more. I just want to just go ahead and focus on my business and just and just do this so I can finish school and help out. Cause we all gonna be straight regardless. It's just I just make I had to do what's best for me and the family as far as that go. I ain't gonna hold y'all too long. I got little clips here and there. It's probably a little short video of it, but um. I'm gonna go ahead and just the light is gonna down rain. And I gotta drive all the way back to the other side. And see, used to traffic so long. So I had to drive all the way back to the other side so I could try to beat the traffic and get home safely. So I ain't gonna see you long, but peace out.